Now that I'm old and grey, I want to tell you my story. May it entertain you, valued friend, or even awaken your spirit of adventure so that you too may make your fortune in the big city as I once did. It was an eventful time, downright dangerous on more than one occasion. In 1347, a caravan arrives in the west, bringing with it the scourge of mankind, the plague. In 1378, the church is riven with envy and discord. In Avignon, an anti-pope is elected. In France, the Hundred Years' War rages on, the French fighting a desperate war of liberation against England. Meanwhile, in the Holy Roman Empire, the young King Wenceslas ascends to the German throne. Will he put an end to the misery? But our village was spared the effects of this turmoil, so I spent long, carefree summer days exploring the deep forest that dominated the surrounding area. And caught my first trouble. Those were the halcyon days of my childhood. When I was 12, I decided to leave the village and go to the city. The day on which I was due to leave soon arrived. My parents accompanied me to the edge of the village and looked at me with a mixture of worry and pride. Good luck, my child, and take care of yourself. And learn something decent, so that you can get on in life. So I took my staff and bag and set off down the dusty, narrow path that led to the big city. After a few hours' walk, I could already make out the imposing walls and towers. stood in front of me, the mighty town where I would make my fortune. Splendid townhouses had been erected. Workers were busy loading crates and barrels for their employers. I thought the merchants must be very prosperous. The alleys were full of the hustle and bustle of trade. Everywhere, craftsmen were going about their work. The market stands displayed wares from all four corners of the world. While in the town hall, important decisions were being made. From this day on, each and every trader entering our town must, by law, pay a toll at the gate. Eventually, it grew dark. So I went in search of a tavern where I could lay my head for the night. I fell asleep contented and dreamt of making my fortune here, in the big city. 